Michael Rockinger is Professor of Finance at HEC Lausanne. In this clip, find out if sustainable finance is compatible with profit-maximizing management. One question that you can have is, uh, is it uh, rational for a manager to invest uh, for the long term? And I would argue that this is indeed uh, something that uh, an investor or a fund manager or some th somebody who is working in a financial institution should absolutely consider. Why is it so important? Well, the answer is because in the 80s, you have had a huge debate about short-term investments. And it was shown, for instance, that uh, companies in the United States um, had managers who were seeking short-term gains. Um, and for this reason, what they did was delocalize much of their production then to foreign countries. For instance, uh, they shipped uh, their production then to Mexico. And one of the bad things in the United States of today is that much of the productive tissue has moved away. Now, it turns out that there are lots of economic theories that tell you you're going to have investors in the aggregate who are going to have risk aversion that changes through time depending on certain macroeconomic variables. And that based on this, one is going to induce macroeconomic cycles also in stock market returns. And it becomes therefore possible for long-term investors to actually time the market and to perform therefore a very long-term portfolio allocation and to perform also very long-term allocations then that are going to be socially beneficial and uh, where you don't uh, have this short-term allocation but where you're going to allocate then for the long-term. Such topics are particularly important if one considers uh, pension funds. Pension funds uh, are institutions that have to allocate for a very, very long time period. And uh, it's going to be good for our futures if those managers think about the long term.